Hello friends, welcome to IBPS guide. So today is day 10 wrong number series. So hope you have been watching videos since day 1 and in video day 8 and day 8 we have introduced number series and in those videos we have talked to find out the missing number series. Okay. So before moving on we would like to discuss some tips and tricks which would help you. So you must remember the squares of the numbers from 1 to 30 this is very important all this have been discussed in the previous videos square root of numbers cube of numbers from 1 to 15 cube root of numbers prime numbers and arithmetic tables okay so let us begin with the question so before attempting looking at the solution please try to solve the problem on your own okay so this is basic level so what the question says is one term in the given number series is wrong okay in the given series one number is wrong you have to point out that number so let us write the series here first 3 8 15 23 and 35 okay so if you add 5 we'll have 8 again if you add 7 we'll have 15 again if you add 8 we'll have 23 but if you see here yeah, these are odd odd again suddenly you are getting even so according to that rule here should it should have been 9 so 15 plus 9 would have been 24 and again according to that rule here it should be plus 11 which are which we are getting 35 so the correct value is 24 the wrong number is 23 so you could take the answer to be c okay so let us move on to question number two let us write the question here first 172 200 263 one four five nine okay difference between these two numbers is 28 again difference between these two numbers is 63 and again difference between these two number if you see 5 2 1 okay now seeing this number a bell must be rung in your head thinking that it is cube of 5 so that is why I have told you to remember the cube from 1 to 15 so let us follow this rule further and check the difference of the other numbers so 14 minus 8 is 6 1 2 okay so this is cube of 6 similarly you can check we will get the cube of this was 5 so this is 6 so 7 cube and 8 cube so the wrong here is this should have been 4 cube and this should have been 3 cube okay what is 3 cube 3 cube is 27 so if you add 27 to this number we will get 199 so the correct value should have been 199 but we have 200 so you could take the answer to be c 200 so let us move on to next question so you can see that the difference is not very much so it must be something related to the difference so let us write the series here 1146 1217 1371 1573 1800 2036 okay so let us check the difference between the numbers 1 then 11 minus 4 is 7 71 and again if you see this is 11 minus 7 is 4 then again we have here 5 again we have here 4 so 154 again the difference between here is 2 0 2 okay and again if we go further we'll check the difference that is 7 2 2 and again if you see the difference it will be something 2 36 but we are not having any pattern so let us do further division between the pairs so if you see this is 3 this is 8 okay now if you see 12 minus 4 is 8 then 48 we get again if you see this is 25 seeing this number it should come to mind it is square of 5 and again if you do this is 9 which is square of 3 so 3 5 7 here it should have been 9 so how will we get 81 here so let us try here by increasing because we are getting difference in uh, mistake in two numbers so it should have been pair of in these three numbers there is some mistake so let us take the middle one and try to increment it by one it is one to one eight so now let us check the difference we'll have here seven two and if you see here yeah, this should be this should be seven two this should be if you see you will get 153 now if you see we'll get the value to be 81 and here if you see the difference it will get we'll get here 12 minus 3 is 949 okay so the correct value should be 1218 but we are getting one correct value but in the question it is 1217 so the correct value should be C 3C so there is a coincidence by mistake that all values comes to be in C option 
so hope this is not C let us see question number four uh, seeing this decimal it should come to mind that it is decimal application of division okay division so let us write the question here 20 14 12 12 10 14.5 so let us see how we could apply division if you do 20 divided by 2 we'll get 10 if you add 4 we'll get 14 okay so this is 14 if you do further division and if you add 5 we'll have here 12 and then 12 divided by 2 plus 6 if you do we'll have 12 again and again 12 divided by 2 plus 7 if you do it should be 12 minus 6 13 but we are having 10 so we have found the culprit here found the culprit so let us see if you follow this rule further we will get 14.5 or not this is 6.5 8 plus 6.5 is 14.5 okay so our culprit is 10 so the correct value should have been 13 so the answer is again C so C seems to be very happy today so let us move on to question number 5 37 40 85 267 1080 okay so how could we get this number so that you can see that the number is becoming very big so it should be application of multiplication let us see how we could get 40 if you do three times we'll get 40 here again if you do multiplication by 2 and if you add 5 we'll get 85 and again 85 into 3 if you do and add 7 we'll get here 262 but we are not getting 267 so there is some mistake in the rule that we are following so let us try with something else 37 into 1 plus 3 will give us 40 then 40 into 2 plus 6 let us check it is giving us 86 so if you get this value then our culprit is 85 so let us see 86 into 3 will give us 38 258 plus 6 if we do will get here 2 8 6 is 18 it should be plus 9 okay so 267 so we have found our, our culprit that is 85 so you won't take the answer to be d hope actually this is d thank god let us move on to the before concluding your video i would like to discuss some tips which i would like to give you so please watch video from day one and solve the problems in the given video okay Solve the PDF given in the description of the video. In most of the videos, we are providing in the description PDF which has some good number of questions, 15 to 20. You must solve those, okay? And practice mocks which are provided in the IBPS guide website and also practice the previous year questions. This will help you a lot. It will give you a mindset of what type of problems you could expect in the exam. So, thank you. And if you like the video, give it a like give it a comment how you feel about the videos if you find it knowledgeable if some mistakes are made or some improvement are to be needed please comment and do subscribe to ibps guide channel and do subscribe with your friends in the social media and also whatsapp group if you have a friend whatsapp group thank you